The heavy duty pickup segment has always been one of the most competitive segments with the likes of Ram, Ford, and Chevy competing for the throne. And for 2024, things are getting even more competitive with manufacturers trying to push the boundaries of what a heavy duty pickup truck can do. Chevy with its Silverado HD is trying to keep its title for the most dependable truck for five years in a row and offer features that'll blow your mind. So stay with us to find out how the all new 2024 Chevy Silverado HD wows everybody. Platform, cab options, and bed size. The Chevy Silverado HD is based on a body-on-frame platform that is shared with many other GM products like the GMC Sierra, Chevy Tahoe, and GMC Yukon. This platform was unveiled in 2018 and is known under the codename GNT1XX. What's worth noting is that for 2024, there will be no changes in this area. The model will retain its platform. In terms of cab offerings, the model will have three options available. The base cab will be the regular cab. For those who don't know, a regular cab is simply a two-door cab without rear seats. This cab type is perfect if you intend to use the truck only for work. Also, the regular cab is the cheapest option available. The other two cab types are the double cab and crew cab. The double cab has rear seats, but the legroom is somewhat tight, so if you carry passengers in the rear, they might feel cramped. What we recommend is to go for the crew cab if you want to have maximum legroom for the passengers in the rear. In terms of bed sizes, there are two options for the Silverado HD 2500 and 3500. The first is the standard bed, and the bigger is the long bed version. The standard bed is 7 feet long, and the long bed is 8 feet long. When it comes to the overall length of the Silverado HD, we can see that it is a pretty massive truck with a maximum length of 241 inches. Our train options. When it comes to powertrain options, there are some small changes for the 2024 model compared to the 2023. The gas-powered engine is the 6.6-liter LT8 V8 naturally aspirated engine that pushes 401 horsepower and 464 pound-feet of torque at 4,000 RPM. As you can tell, this engine does not have that low-end torque and responsiveness that a turbocharged engine has. The main change with the 6.6-liter V8 will be the implementation of a new 10-speed Allison transmission. This transmission has four more speeds compared to the six-speed automatic that was used until 2023, which is really nice to have for better fuel economy. The second engine is the 6.6-liter Duramax V8. This engine for 2024 will output more power. The engine is rated at 470 horsepower and 975 pound-feet of torque at 1,600 RPM. This engine is turbocharged and the low-end torque is massive, with a 25% increase in low-end torque compared to the 2023 model. It can practically move a mountain with this engine. The transmission used with this engine is the same Allison 10 speed, which is a really nice transmission that delivers extremely good shifts. Towing and payload capability. When it comes to the towing and payload, the numbers are higher on this new model compared to the previous model year because of the refinements in the powertrain department that we noted. The numbers really depend on the engine you go for, as well as the cab type. The numbers that the gas-powered engine delivers are a bit worse compared to the Duramax diesel. The maximum tow rating for the 6.6-liter gas engine is 19,090 pounds, while the 6.6-liter Duramax can tow up to 36,000 pounds, according to Chevy's official website. The Silverado HD also allows a gooseneck or a fifth-wheel trailer to be attached with a maximum tow rating of 30,000 pounds. According to Chevy, for this type of pulling, you'll need to opt for the regular cab work truck version with two-wheel drive, Duramax diesel engine, and the max trailering package. In terms of payload, the Silverado HD has a maximum rating of 3,340 pounds. The exact number really depends on the type of bed you go for, as well as whether you opt for the dually or the standard drivetrain. Overall, the 6.6 Duramax powertrain that is used in the Silverado is one of the most impressive ones on the market, and if you're into buying, one of these trucks is definitely worth your attention. Fuel Economy the fuel economy on the Silverado HD is pretty poor, we must admit. These heavy-duty trucks are not intended to deliver fuel economy but towing performance. So if this is the thing you're interested in, a smaller truck like the Silverado 1500 with the 2.7-liter engine might be a better buy. When it comes to the numbers, the 6.6-liter gasoline engine should deliver around 12 mpg in the city and 14 mpg on the highway. The 6.6-liter Duramax diesel is more economical. Since it's diesel, this engine does not consume a lot of fuel. The fuel economy for this engine is rated at 19 mpg on the highway and around 15 mpg in the city. Trim Levels 
when it comes to trim levels, there are six trim levels in total for the Silverado HD, and these are the following. The most basic trim level that you can get is the work truck trim. This work truck trim lacks a lot of the commodities and features that higher end trucks have. They don't have leather upholstery or soft touch materials, which is a shame. But as its name implies, this is a work truck intended purely for work duties. Then, in the lineup, you have the custom trim level. The custom is basically a work truck with options. The work truck usually comes in white and with a chrome grill, so what the custom trim level gives you are the options to get a blacked out front grill, more color options, and more features. If you want to upgrade and get a more luxurious model, you can either get the LT or LTZ. These two models, in our opinion, are the sweet spot if you want to get a good truck on a budget. Then, if you have the High Country, the High Country is the most luxurious model in the Silverado HD lineup. It's full of leather, soft-touch materials everywhere, luxury features, and big screens. Basically everything that an owner wants, but it also comes at a steep price. And the top trim and main talking point when it comes to the 2024 Silverado HD is probably the ZR2 Bison. The ZR2 Bison was introduced recently, and this truck is expected to be the top truck that money can buy. The ZR2 combines a work truck with off-road capabilities, and honestly, at first glance, this truck looks spectacular. It features custom off-road suspension with massive wheels and tires. The sheer size limits this truck a little bit, but this is somewhat expected. Exterior Design the exterior of the new Silverado has slightly changed as well. The 2024 model has an improved presence on the road with a more muscular styling and unique headlight design as well as an updated front grille. This new 2024 model incorporated new C-shaped daytime running lights, higher-end trims, get dual projector LED headlights with animated welcome and departure animation, which is a trend nowadays. In addition to this, you also have the Chevrolet name scripted on the hood scoop. Tow hooks come as standard as well as new 6 exterior colors. Some new additions to the color lineup include Dark Ash, Sterling Gray, Auburn Metallic, and Radiant Red. Later on, two colors will be available, and these include the Meteorite Metallic and Lakeshore Blue Metallic. The new model also features some side bed steps for you to be easily able to climb on the bed, as well as a six-position tailgate with a 120-watt outlet. Interior Design and Technology the interior was also heavily inspired on the 2024 Silverado HD model. It is worth noting that on the work truck and the custom trims, the interior will not change a lot. While on the LT, LTZ, High Country, and ZR2, the interior will see a revolution. The fresh look was more than welcomed after all these years. So on the higher-end trims, you'll get a 12.3-inch screen for the digital cluster and a massive 13.4-inch for the infotainment system. What Chevy also did quite well in terms of the design is the fact that they retain many of the physical dials for controlling the systems in the car. And people who are not into tech will really appreciate this move by Chevy. You also have a lot of trailering features such as blind zone alert, adaptive cruise control and trailering, and transparent trailer view. Right. When it comes to pricing, the Silverado HD 2024 model is expected to start at $45,295 for the regular cab work truck, according to Chevy's official website. For a work truck crew cab standard bed truck, you'll have to pay about $48,795, and if you want the 6.6 .6 Duramax turbo diesel, you'll have to pay around $59,000. And as you go up in the trims, the prices understandably increase. So the same cabin engine, high-spec country, will cost you $82,385. For the ZR2, there's no information on the pricing just yet, but when there is, we will be happy to inform you all of that. And that's all for today's video. Thanks for watching and see you in the next one.